Hey everyone, let's dive into some recent political tensions in Europe. European Commission President Ursula von der Leyen has publicly criticized Hungary's stance on Russia and China, calling it a security threat to Europe. During a heated debate with Hungarian Prime Minister Viktor Orban, von der Leyen didn't hold back. She slammed Hungary for its reluctance to support Ukraine amidst Russian aggression. She also took issue with Hungary's visa program, which benefits Russians and Belarusians the presence of Chinese police patrols in Hungary and the country's continued dependence on Russian energy. Orban, clearly taken aback by von der Leyen's bluntness, quickly refuted any parallels drawn between Hungary's 1956 uprising and the ongoing conflict in Ukraine. Instead, he advocated for a ceasefire in Ukraine. This clash underscores the growing tension between Hungary and the EU the EU has previously censured Orban's government for undermining democratic principles and fostering close ties with Russia and China. The EU's concerns aren't baseless. Hungary's alignment with Russia and China is increasingly at odds with the bloc's values and security interests. Hungary's resistance to supporting Ukraine and its welcoming stance towards Russian and Chinese influence raise serious concerns. These actions could weaken the EU's united front against external threats and undermine its strategic autonomy. Now let's zoom out a bit. The political landscape in Europe has been evolving dramatically, primarily due to security concerns stemming from Russia. This shift has led to a greater appreciation for European integration and a stronger European Union. Russian aggression has notably impacted European political parties. Far-right Eurosceptic parties, especially those in countries near Russia, are losing influence. Their previous sympathetic stance towards Russia is becoming increasingly untenable. Meanwhile, centre-right parties advocating for a strong EU and transatlantic partnership are gaining traction. Scandals involving Russian interference in European politics, particularly attempts to influence far-right politicians, have further heightened security concerns. These revelations have prompted a reassessment of political alliances and priorities. So, what does all this mean? The evolving security landscape in Europe, shaped by the threat from Russia, is reshaping political dynamics. Actors who prioritize a strong and unified European front alongside robust transatlantic relations are now in the spotlight. Stay tuned for more updates on this evolving story. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more insightful political analysis. Thanks for watching.